Hey everyone, thanks for watching. We're in Fishtown, which is directly in Leland, and we're talking to Michelle White about a couple of things. First, we'll talk a little bit about your jewelry. Uh, you have something called 45th Attitude, and this is relatively new for you, is it not? It's pretty new, and um, I've lived here a long time, and people are constantly getting their picture taken in front of the 45th parallel sign. Right. And I've said for years that I think that it's the energy that brings all this eclectic, artsy, bizarro type people <laughs> right. to our area. Yeah, yeah. So I thought what would be something that would be more memorable than jewelry. And so we started designing some jewelry and it is actually made at Corner Gem. So we're still in Leelanau County. And now, how do you get into that? I mean, what, what do you do to start doing something like that? Well, you find an amazing silversmith okay. to uh, make you a prototype. Sure which I did that, yeah. and it was the um, late Annie McFarland, so that's really awesome, mm -hmm. so that's memory of her. And um, then you find somebody that can actually produce them, and I went to Kevin Gothier at Corner Gem, and he did that for me, and now we're off and running with uh, quite a few designs. I've got some necklaces, some earrings, ring, and um, it's just a lot of fun. And here at Fishtown, you can find your stuff, what, at the Catbird Seat? At the Catbird Seat, right. yep. So so you, on Lake Street. You, you go to Fishtown and you're looking for jewelry, or you can go over and have a, a sandwich at the Cheese Shanty and then come on over to the Catbird Seat and then visit the Welcome Center over there uh, uh, for Fishtown and yep. make a day of it. Yep, and the Catbird Seat has all kinds of art from local artists. We have um, painters, we have fibers, we have um, uh, jewelers, mm -hmm. <laughs> just a ton of really yeah. cool stuff in there. All right, Check it out. something you and I have talked about before is your bags of compassion. You want to explain what bags of compassion is? Bags of compassion is a, a trade show bag, because they're a good size, and right. sturdy bags filled with things that if you found yourself maybe in transition and on the street that uh, you could maybe enjoy for a while. I, I try to put food and as many hygienic things as you can, toothbrush, toothpaste, soap, shampoo, um, as much non-perishable food as I can get, gloves, hats. And then who are you giving this to? Then I leave these mostly by um, churches outside the door. I see. And um, as far as I know, about 146 of them have been taken. I don't exactly know where they go, right. but I'm I believe that they're going to where they need to be. Now, in these bags of compassion, you put stuff, but where do you get that stuff? Well, I ask for donations, yep. and I myself buy things, and I just try to collect as much as I can. Um, anybody that doesn't want their gloves or hats, scarves, sweater, small blankets, any of that. I'll, I'll take whatever would fit in a trade show bag. Right. Plus, you also talked about non-perishables and things that people use on a daily basis toothbrush, hairbrushes, toothpaste, things yep. of that nature. Yep. Right. That, um, you know, fruit cups, snack bars, tuna. If you maybe were camping, you know, what would you, what mm -hmm. would you take? Really? What got you into that? Um, tra uh, during my travels, I notice a lot of people that are in situations that I, I've just, I don't know, it just breaks my heart. Mm -hmm. So I feel like there's my little piece to try to help in the compassion that we seem to not have as much as we right. could have right. in life. All right. Now, if people want to donate or find out more about all this, where can they go? I have a Facebook page called Bags of Compassion, and um, that would probably be the best place to right. go to Facebook, Bags of Compassion. Right. All right. All right. Thank you very much, Michelle. Thanks, 40, 40 Fifth Attitude. 40 Fifth Attitude. For, for that, where can people go? to the catbird seat right. on Lake Street in Leland. Very nice. And then bags of compassion. And then in this bag quickly, because we're running out of time, but what do you, like, just pull out a couple of different things so we can show um, folks. I've got socks. You've got socks, because people Lake always Lake. need socks. And yeah. also I have a drop-off at the Red Top Pastoria in Lake Leland. It's a new, awesome pizza. Oh, pastoria. very nice. Okay. Toothbrush. Yeah, you've got all sorts of stuff in there. This one happens to have slippers, a Perfect. blanket. Perfect. Perfect. So whatever you you know whatever you think would be helpful and would go in this bag, I would certainly appreciate it. Excellent. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you, Vic. In Fishtown, Leland, I'm Vic McCarty. My News 26.